What's up, LTD addicts? It's that time of the year again. Deposit Photos is back at AppSumo. Now, in this video, I'm gonna explain why Deposit Photos is actually a great deal, even if you already have something like Stencil, which has 2.2 million stock photography photos inside of it. Stay tuned. Hey everyone, I'm Dave from ThatLTD.life where I review software tools with lifetime offers. To follow along with this deposit photos review, you can click the link in the description. That is the referral link for this channel. So anytime you go to shop at AppSumo, I do appreciate you clicking that link. It helps support the creation of reviews like this one. And just a real quick thank you to everyone who's been watching the channel, commenting and using that referral link. It really does mean a lot. All right, let's get right into it. Here is deposit photos on AppSumo. Now, if you're a longtime AppSumo user, you know that deposit photos comes back at least once a year and they are back again it is that time a year again and you know what I'm glad that it returns uh, sometimes I don't like to see deals reappearing on AppSumo year after year because it might mean that the company doesn't have a real plan for sustainability However, with deposit photos, I think they're just giving a little bit of a discount to us uh, in terms of a way to reach a larger audience. And you know what? It's a great deal. It's something that you use. So you might want to make a habit of buying a code or two every time you see it on AppSumo. Let's take a look at the deal here and see what you're going to get. So for 49 bucks, you're basically getting 100 images and you can stack that as many times as you want. There's no additional features that are unlocked for extra stacking, but you can buy as many codes as you want. So if you're a web developer or you do a lot of ads and you need to go through a lot of images, uh, then this is definitely the deal for you. As we're going to see in a little bit later in the video, this is definitely the lowest cost for premium images on a price per image basis. So the way this works is you get 100 credits for one code and a credit is essentially one image on deposit photos and you have lifetime access. The credits never expire. So you can buy three or four codes and use it over the next three or four years if you don't use a lot of images. Now, in a moment, I'm going to be comparing deposit photos to Adobe Stock, and we'll also take a look at the free Pexels stock photography website. But let's talk about why you need stock photography at all. Now, if you're running any sort of Facebook ad or a landing page where you're driving paid traffic to it, and you're not using a photograph with a human being smiling, looking back at your prospect, chances are you're leaving some money on the table. Now, I'm a marketer, so for me, this comes down to the bottom line. When you take high-quality images, and for most people, you're going to want to look for images of people smiling and enjoying your product or service, and you place them on your website, your landing page, or inside of your advertisements, it increases your conversion rate. We have enough data. We just know this to be true. Now, it's obviously best if you get a custom photographer, the perfect model for your product or service, and you do a custom photo shoot. However, this isn't in the budget for every client, so stock photography comes to the rescue. Now, with so many free stock photography websites available, why would you choose a premium site over using one of the free ones? Well, let's investigate a little bit here. So I've got Adobe Stock loaded up, and I went ahead and I searched for weight loss. And we get some pretty nice photos here. You get some before and after shots. We get, you know, the classic, my jeans now are super baggy shot. We get all of these, you know, pretty interesting shots. They look genuine. We've all seen photos like this before. Here's another nice before and after shot. So these are really high quality images, and I think they'd be pretty effective for any sort Sort of marketing related to weight loss. Now I did the same search on Pexels, which is a free stock photography website, and you can see the results just really aren't as good. Sure, you've got some fit people over here, but that doesn't scream weight loss to me. Uh, I've got these ladies over here in the gym uh, lifting some free weights. You know, I've seen this photo probably four or five dozen times at this point. It's very generic to me, and as soon as I see it, I know that the brand has just grabbed a free stock photo. To me, that's a kiss of death. I don't want my customers to know I'm using free stock photography. Uh, you can see that overall, just the images don't really uh, pertain to the subject matter as well. I'm just getting a lot of workout photos versus the Adobe version, which was clearly about weight loss, right? We're getting some scales, we're getting a lot of before and after shots. Uh, so definitely higher quality on the Adobe stuff. So I think it's easy for everyone to agree that the content on Adobe stock was more relevant to the search term, higher quality, and more original looking than what we found on Pexels. So how does deposit photos fit into all this? Well, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised to learn that it's very similar to what you find on Adobe stock. So the premium photographers that are doing these stock photography shoots are licensing the material to both sites. Although sometimes photos are exclusive from one site to another. So here we go. Here's deposit photos. You can see this is all very 
relevant to the search term of weight loss. Uh, I'm getting some before and after photos. Uh, there's quite a few of those actually. Here's a nice illustration. Here's a male version, kind of a funny photo of a man fitting uh, both of his legs into one side of his pants. Uh, so overall, I'd say the quality is right up there on par with Adobe stock. Let's talk about value here. Is AppSumo actually giving us a good deal? So for 49 bucks, you're gonna get access to download a hundred photos or vectors. There's no limitation on when you download them. You could download them all tomorrow or you could disperse them over the next several years. It's up to you. Now let's compare this to Adobe Stock. Adobe Stock wants a year long commitment to you where you're paying $30 a month and you're getting access to 10 images each month. Ooh, that's not sounding so good, right? So our price per image is $3 for Adobe. We're only getting 10 at a time. And if you compare that to AppSumo, we are getting 50 cents per image and we can access them whenever we want. Now, of course, if we agree to download more images from Adobe, the price per image goes down. See, the next plan up here is $2 per image or $80 per month. However, we're still not even close to approaching that 50 cents per image uh, allotment and you're only getting 40 images in a month. What if you need more for a web project? You're gonna have to spend out of pocket for additional images. Now, to be fair here, we should compare this to the typical pricing for deposit photos. Now, they do have a subscription plan, as you might expect, and nothing that matches the AppSumo deal exactly, although for 75 images per year, you're looking at $700. So again, not exactly cheap here. They do have a flexible plan where you agree to pay them $30 per month and you get 30 assets per month. So that's a dollar an image. That's still the best pricing we've seen uh, aside from the AppSumo deal. Or they do have an on-demand uh, where you can say get say 25 images for hundred bucks. So that's $4 per image. Man, nothing is even coming close to this AppSumo deal. So it's clearly a good value. So I've established how important it is to use photos on your website and in your marketing. But if you don't want to be generic or blend in with the crowd and you really want your brand to stand out, you need to use premium stock photography that you don't find everywhere. Deposit photos is on par with the industry leading Adobe stock. However, the cost is a fraction of the price. So for that reason, I'm gonna give this deal a solid 9.5. I hope it continues to re return to AppSumo year after year. I know I'll continue to buy. If this review has been helpful to you, please go ahead and make a purchase at AppSumo using the link in the description. I'll make it totally clear that these reviews are honest and my own opinions. I'm never trying to persuade anyone to buy something that they don't need. But if you want to support this review channel, go ahead and make a purchase using that link. I greatly appreciate it. And if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, click the notification bell so you get notified when new reviews are posted, and maybe smash that like button for me, huh? What do you think? All right, see you in the next review. Cause all I